Hey everyone, I wanted to share this confrontation with you all because I know how frustrating it can be to deal with toxic exes. I secretly recorded this conversation because I wanted to expose Kyle's true colors, but what you'll see is how Curtis's temper escalated and honestly, it scared me. I'm still trying to process everything, but I want to be transparent with you all. Kyle, what the fuck are you doing in this voice chat? Can't you see Sarah's happier with me now? Mind your fucking business, Curtis. I just want to talk to Sarah. Kyle, we've been over this. I'm with Curtis now. Please leave us alone. You're making a fucking mistake, Sarah. Curtis is not fucking good enough for you. How fucking dare you? You have no fucking right to judge me. You're the one who treated Sarah like shit. You cheated on her, lied to her, and drained her uh, bank account with your uh, gambling addiction. That was just a stupid mistake, okay? I've changed. No, Kyle. You haven't fucking changed. You're still drinking excessively and gambling away your life. Yeah, and now you're harassing Sarah, trying to get back together with her. Leave her alone, Kyle. I just want to fucking talk to her. I love her. Love. You call stalking me and sending me threatening messages love. No, Kyle. That's not love. Kyle, you're such a fucking toxic influence on Sarah. You're not good for her. Leave her alone before I take action. You think you're so fucking tough, Curtis. Bring it on. I'll show you what a real fucking man looks like. I'm not fucking afraid of you, Kyle, but I will protect Sarah from you. You're not going to hurt her again. Curtis, stop. Please. Just let him go. Fine, but Kyle, remember what I said. Leave Sarah alone or face the consequences of your fucking actions. This isn't fucking over. I'm fucking ready for you, Kyle. Bring it the fuck on if you can. Curtis, please. Just let it go. Fucking fine, but Kyle, you're not welcome in this voice chat. Or in Sarah's life. Good fucking bye. Huh. You think you can kick me the fuck out? I'll just reconnect dumbass. Kyle, you're really testing my patience, you motherfucker. Oh, I'm shaking in my fucking boots, Curtis. You should be. Uh, you're dealing with me now, and I'm not afraid of you. You're a worthless piece of shit, Kyle. You treat women like shit and expect them to come crawling back to you? You're a fucking joke. Whoa, okay. I get it. You're mad. Mad? I'm beyond mad. I'm livid. You're lucky I'm not there in person, or I'd show you what a real man looks like. You're a drunk, a gambler, and a cheater. You're not worthy of Sarah's love. Okay, okay. I get it. I made mistakes. Can we just move on? Move on? You think you can just move on from what you did to Sarah? No, Kyle. You need to face the consequences of your actions. You need to leave Sarah the fuck alone and never come back. Curtis, please, please, stop. You're scaring me. No worries, Sarah. I'm just trying to protect you from this toxic piece of shit. Kyle, stay away from Sarah or face the consequences of your fucking actions, kid. Okay, okay. Uh, I'll leave her alone. Just calm down, Curtis. You'd fucking better. I'm watching you, Kyle. And if you ever come near uh, Sarah again, you'll regret it. Curtis, come on. Let's talk about this like adults. I know I messed up, but I want to make it right. Make it right? Do you think you can uh, just apologize and everything will be okay? No, Kyle. You're beyond forgiveness. You're a toxic piece of shit and I don't want you near Sarah. Curtis, please. Calm down. Kyle is trying to make amends. Amends? He's just trying to save his own skin. He doesn't even care about you, Sarah. He only cares about himself. That's not true, Curtis. I, I love Sarah and I want to make things right between us. Love? You don't even know the fucking meaning of the word. You're a user, Kyle. You use people for your own gain and then discard them when you're done. Curtis, stop. Please. You're scaring me. Scaring you? Good. Maybe you'll fucking finally see the fucking truth about Kyle. He's a fucking monster, Sarah. And I'm not gonna let him hurt you again. Curtis, please. Listen to me. I'm trying to change. I want to be a better person for Sarah. Change? You're beyond change, Kyle. You're a lost cause and I'm not gonna waste my fucking time on you. Get out of my fucking sight, Kyle. You're not fucking welcome here. You're fine. I'll leave. But this isn't over, Curtis. Oh, I'm fucking shaking in my boots. Get the fuck out. Curtis, hey. It's okay, he's gone now. I don't even want to fucking talk about Sarah. I'm still fucking angry. I understand. 
but you need to calm down. You're scaring me. Listen, I'm sorry, Sarah. I don't mean to scare you. It's just Kyle gets under my fucking skin like no one else does. I know. But you can't let him get to you like this. You're better than that. I know, you're right. I just need a minute to calm down. Or take all the time you need. I'm here for you. Thanks, Sarah. I'm sorry for losing my temper like that. It's okay. I, I understand. Let's just move on from this and focus on us, okay? Okay. I love you, Sarah. I love you too, Curtis. <laughs>